day, YouTube. We're entering hour four of our Hall and Night Odyssey. Um, and, uh, you know, hour three was a frustrating session of soft locks due to not having a vertical movement skill. But, however, as you can see now, um, we have Menace Claw. So we can go, we can actually progress where we were having difficulties before. So. Um, you know, some of the places where we were getting soft locked were waterways. We had no way to get up top uh, with the entrance that we had. Um, uh, ancient Basin, the Abyss, tons of places where we got soft locked. So we are in business. We are missing now, for those keeping track at home, we're missing two movement based skills. One is the Shadow Dash, um, and the second is. Um, really want to listen to you. Second uh, moving base skill we're missing is going to be um, um, just checking all those areas is um, the uh, double jump. And there is some double jump specific block spaces and there's some shadow jump or shadow dash specific block spaces. So we do have some work to do for our movement based skills, but we have horizontal skills, we have vertical skills. Um, we can do, we can make do with these sets of skills for most areas. So um, we're gonna have a lot, this is gonna be a very productive hour, um, hopefully. First thing I wanna do is go back to uh, Royal Waterways. Um, and kind of should with, with even without double jump should be able to full full clear royal waterway so that's going to be the goal here I believe this is the way to royal waterways yes okay so first we can see get the map here open that did this whole fight oh he's gone all right well you know Who's, who's keeping track? All right. So this is still an annoying zone to be knocked down to the water down below, but uh, now we can actually climb up here and make progress. All right. Missed me. I guess we have a distance to spawn those guys. I think this is the... No. I just wasted my entire time. Alright. Still get back up there. See what we can make do with these movement skills. Alright. So this is not a rancid egg, so what is this? This is... King's Idol. Not bad, not bad. Money, money, money. Um, we still have a lot of things to buy. So, um, that is definitely all going to be very helpful. Ooh, what is this? Can we get up here? Answer? I think so? This is an awkward wall kick. Are we supposed to be able to get up here? Probably not, but can we? Not uh, engaging that wall. Alright, so maybe waterways is still blocked off for us. Go figure. Unless there's a way to get up from over here. Let's see. If we are afford a way to get up. I feel like we should be able to get back up on top. Yeah, there we go. No, that's just the egg. Alright, a little beast ball. Yeah, we can definitely get up on one of those. There we go. Alright, alright, we're in business. Bench if you break that, and that's Dung Defender down there. Am I missing anything else up here though? That is the bench to lead to Dung Defender. Oh, that's stupid. I don't have double jump. I just walked right off without double jump. 
Honestly, this is a super annoying room. anything here or is this just no it's all a big waste of time come on come on come on there you go all right so that's just bringing me up here and there's nothing to loot up here so we are good all right let's go back and uh, next boss dung defender perhaps the most ridiculous boss in this game um Is a necessary boss to kill. But he's just straight. He's just straight crazy. Not a very hard boss, to be honest. I like how these two are attached together. It's weird, it's like you got larva and worms, lamprey like mouths that are coming after you. Yeah, it's still very cutesy. Alright, so that is a Prince of Egg Tell. Let's go get that. You know that this can be anything. Gotta get all these rancid eggs. What are you giving me? The Shriek. Alright, we take that. That is a very strong spell. And timely against Dung Defender who likes to attack from the top. Whoa! It's a big fail. Oh ho ho! Defender on a pile of dung. Inspired. Let's go. Me and you. Let's go. Very difficult boss here. Sounds like he's having so much fun, too. This is a soft rage time. We're just... Are you serious? Oh my gosh. That is more than a little disgraceful. Alright. In front of you, YouTube, fortunately no one looks at the past hour, the first hour and the last hour, but my sins are laid bare. I just died at Dun Defender. That is atrocious. I was being too, I wasn't doing his uh, mechanics, I was being too cocky. It's ridiculous. Beat Hollow Vessel and Greater Maldrung and died to Dumb Defender. And I have Abyss Shriek. Alright. 
Let's go. Stop vibrating my controller. Now it's personal. That was a disgraceful death. My sins are laid bare. What do you got for me? Hollow nest seal. A whole lot of nothing. Now is this a different... No. So I already have access to the top half of this room. However, I can actually climb this room now. Now that's worth something. What is this? Yeah. Okay. Now let's see. This goes down to the abyss. Where does it actually ch change to, though? All right, let's see what this zone uh, transition is. See, so there is a item over here. I'm thinking about it. Right here. What do you got? Stalwart shell with a ton of required. Get over here. No. Uh, I really don't like that one. Let's go. Okay. This is technically not the hive, or this is technically the hive? Whoops. This is, I know this is the transition between. I think Royal Waterways in the Hive. Be honest, this is a room like I never come to. Come here. 
Um, was that the only way out of that room? Like, I think that's actually the correct transition point, but isn't there a way down, too? Or is there not? Yeah, there is a way down. Okay, let's go down here. Let's see, this is not too bad platforming here, but there is multiple ways to enter the hive. Whoa. Oh my gosh. It's the Keanu Reeves, whoa. Remember, you have to break. You have to break the hive honeycomb somewhere. It's in the next screen. Let's check the next screen. Not there. one entrance. This is not the right entrance, though. It's interesting that they kept that transition the same. This is the last place in the game that I found in vanilla. Which I think is a pretty common statement for a lot of people. It's kind of hard to find and it's not required in the normal not required for the normal plot. Looks like I need double jump. Oops, come here. Couple item points here. Nothing like super big. Um, of course, anything could be anything, so we'll see if we can full clear the high without double jump. That initial. That initial jump was. To me, was suggesting that they want me to have double jump, but. There's a lot of bees to bounce off of here, so. The hive is on the southeast part of the kingdom. This is where it's supposed to be in relation to Kingdom's Edge. Um, it's just not... There's nothing useful in it. There's, I think hive blood is in it, which is good for the White Palace, but there's almost nothing helpful in the hive. And so, as such, not a place that I go to often. Job. But doable with Mantis Claw. Whoops. To 
disengage that the wrong way. I keep on thinking I have double jump. I keep on trying to double jump here. Alright, let's see. Uh, 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 uh. There we go. Man, when you have somebody who's really good at this game, doing uh, movement skills, it's... It's almost poetry. That's clearly not me, but... It's just a pretty game that way. I should get back into the, uh, get into the Hollow Knight speedrunning slash randomizer community. This game's so cool. I'm not sure if randomizer <laughs> really works with all the soft locks that I've been getting into, but, uh, you know, still cool. That is a big B. No, that is one. Oh, I my platform. Pretty sure you have to use those big fatty bees to break open some goodies for you somewhere. Could have made a way. Yeah, this is the other exit I knew was there. We could have made a way cooler hive boss. I think all you do is face like a knight or something here. I remember it being pretty anticlimactic. Ooh, it's a two for. hard to climb to the top of this room. Unless I camp them here. Don't want these guys to charge me and destroy more platforms though. I suppose if you're supposed to have double jump here, this is supposed to be a late stage um, zone. Late game zone. Still, though, I mean. These guys do a ton of damage. Right, how do I get out of this room without double jump? That looks like it's possible. <clears throat> Come on. Come here, little bee. I need you. I need you, little bee. Nope. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're almost in the perfect spot. Jump up, little bee. Yeah, little bee is a hero. Destroying my platforms. No, that's my fault. I jumped too early. Yep. Down here, no problem. Oh, more gold. That's always good. Oh, he came. Oh, shouldn't have done that. Now, as they say, yeah, that is where high blow 
blood is, I think, in the normal game. But we can go on to the boss fight. Now let's see. Okay. Doing good. Yes, I need the guy to break this. Almost. Big fat bee. Come break that. That one. That's the bee I need. Big fat bee. Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Whoa! Yeah, you man. Too bad you stuck now. Alright, what do we got? City crust. Completely useless. That connects over there. To do all these weird double jump things. I feel like there's another save before the. Oh. No. Say it ain't so. Alright, how do I get up there? Oh no, that was it. Let me see. Yeah, okay. It's not so bad. Okay, bye. Totally don't remember. That's the queen. Totally don't remember what this guy does. bunch of bees. 
happens if I... Let's see. So I open up a way that hopefully means I do not have to do all these convoluted double jumps. I just lose a bunch of gold. Can I have two souls? I think I just lost a bunch of gold. Mm, my impatience. Where is... This the entrance. Right there? No, it's up there. Where is she? There. If I have to do B double jump skips again. I'm in some like horror film. We shouldn't have come here. Is this not the entrance? Thought I opened up a side path. It's not here in this room? Oh, that's so incredibly disappointing. Like Hansel. Oh, you want to be around when I made a mistake. This is it, YouTube. And you're supposed to say, I take it back. This is the entrance. Okay. Just gotta know where the cross back over is. So there is...
This is like a bad game of ping pong. One more look at this guy. If he's too painful, then we will skip him. I do not know his mechanics very well, but it looks like he's a jump slash on him. Wow, those just don't die. further. Keep on thinking that's invincible. I'm dead. Yeah. He's not bad, but I think I've got to pass on him for now. come back to him. Let's do the kingdom's eggs edge exit. Because I have to get my soul, huh? Doesn't matter if I want to pass on him. Don't have any. If I had, if I had a little bit of range, even long nail would be enough. These sword and board fights would be easy. And then I don't have any sort of charms to make any any other type of build. Stuck with sword and board. Almost pulled that. Oh my goodness. Well, I will get my. Soul back. Will not have any money again, but I already lost my money, so it doesn't matter. I'm sick of the hive, let's get out of here. Get out of here. Let's make like a tree and leaf. Leave me alone, I'm still weak.
Which there's still another. Still another exit over here. I don't know what that exit is, but Kingdom's Edge is pretty good. Maybe it's just trolley. My gosh, I want to double jump so bad. Let's find this other exit. Kingdom's Edge we go. An actual level I'm supposed to be in. So Coliseum is an interesting challenge. I think it should say on the sign what the uh, rewards are. Hopefully nothing is locked behind. Fool. The one thing about um, Kingdom's Edge music is it always makes me feel like my cell phone's going off. It's like ding! Because these weird dings in the middle. There's Neil Smith over here. Got into a rhythm with these guys again. Seems about right. This this guy's usually take three hits from me. Vessel fragment. Well, that sucks. All right. All right, here we go. Let's go deep into the pit and see what we have in store. Fortunately, they give you this right at the beginning because you're going to need it. This is an entire loop. This is where you normally get um, quick slash, so it would be nice to actually. Um, see what is here instead. I don't know where these mosquitoes come from, but they're annoying. So, right now it's about midnight and for some reason every time every time i play this game it's like yeah it's late at night right when you get to kingdom's edge and the serene lullaby -like music starts to play and you're just like oh man i'm just like I'm lulled to sleep It's got to be almost dead. That's the bad one. Okay.
I'm awake. I'm awake now. fall asleep and get killed by giant hopping mosquitoes. Oh my gosh. What a noob. There we go. Sounds like a rancid egg. I didn't find the egg and that could be uh Where is that coming from? Oh, is it? That's where I fell down. Looks like I need double a jump to get it, so. Always an annoying run that you try and do as quickly as early in the game as possible because um, gives you the quick slash. And this is the other side of Hive. There. hour and this is normally where you get quick slash so we already have quick slash so Yoni's blessing yeah yeah whoa whoa sniper satisfying cycle with these big ones not too bad um, so I missed that rancid egg I'm actually not sure I got better go back and find it it's an item Oh, I think you know what? I think you have to drop on the side wall one of those dashes down. And you can't do it the first time because you're dashing down. Let's go. I still thought there was like a dash of, I think I, I think I drop here. Yeah, right there. Okay. Let's go. What do you got for me? You have 100 crystal heart. What is that? I actually have no idea what that is. Crystal heart. Yeah, what's a hundred crystal heart? Uh, okay. Not sure. Alright, but... Just do this cycle one more time. 
These guys always come back. I don't know why the mosquitoes come back and nothing else does, but not complaining about not having to face those. I don't know. Wax wasps? I don't know what the things that shoot at you are. They're annoying. That's what they are. Now I get the, uh, totally get the bees coming back. I can totally get behind that. Now, there is a way to climb up over here. Where is it? Yeah, it's right there. There we go. I can actually get the Hornet too, too. This is probably my least favorite track in the entire game. Just because it's just this like wandering, repeating. It's almost reminiscent. It's like the Hollow Knight version of the Mario Brothers uh, castle music. It's just like the same four measures over and over again. Can't do that. Not that it probably matters since there's something random behind there. first. These bees, they're annoying. Sucker! Let's go! Get good! So they interviewed the um, producers of this game, and the infamous the community had long ago concluded that Hornet says get good right when you face uh, Radiance for the first time when she's holding back the uh, Hollow Knight. Um, but they said, actually, no, it wasn't supposed to be that. It was just supposed to be something else entirely different. It's like, oh, okay. They said it was a happy coincidence that it sounded like Get Good, which was obviously a gaming meme. Pro I would say almost because of that. I mean, certainly the phrase like existed before then, but I think Hollow Knight definitely added to its uh, wild popularity. Come this way. Come here. Come here, come here, come here. No, 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 come here. Alright, let's forget it. I don't like you either. So you can use a uh, horn, uh, B double jump there to go up to Hornet 2. Which we will try again, I suppose. Now, I have no idea, like, God, these bees are annoying. They are truly one of my least favorite monsters in the entire thing. Let's go see what the Coliseum has to offer us. But I have no idea, um, what they were thinking with these bees. They are just annoying.
kind of tickle, tickle the tail a little bit. Seems appropriate. Alright. Come here, you bee. Tell you what, this zone is a heck of a lot more fun with double jump. Yes, you are annoying. Congratulations. Alright, so let's see if we can get to the Coliseum from here. Half good. If I was really good, I would have pogoed there too. Alright. It's like I've never been over here. What's over here? Nothing important. And a nuke trap. So special. So it looks like Coliseum is attached. Alright, let's see what our rewards for the Coliseums are. Fight for King So One and Geo. No. Fight for Rancid Egg and Geo, definitely not. Fight for Geo and the Glory Being Fool. So, I need to do the first one, I guess, to get King So. Probably would be good. All right. So, I don't like going into Coliseum without increased length, but increased uh, uh, range, but let's take a look. Let's take a look. Could probably put on fragile strength to be honest. Kill this guy by from above. <sighs> yeah, I can't do anything if you attack him from above. Coliseum comes uh, with waves of monsters, and you quickly learn which are the uh, waves that you're supposed to be getting back souls on, and which are the stressful waves. I remember each of these waves as they come, but I don't actually remember what wave is next. I want to say a big fat guy is next, or like the boomerang guys are next, the boomerang bugs. Big fat guy, yeah, it's a big fat guy. Oh yeah, you, get, you just swing into these guys. It's not really a big deal. So let's go. Over here. 
heal and heal. I want to say next round is like spikes. So we're going to have to get up off. This is not fun with that double jump. Yeah, that's why. Where am I going now? Oh, I'm going to this side. Oh, no. Yeah. Knock them into the uh, spikes pretty easily. Whoops. Oh, so easy. I like how the drum beats get faster and faster. In the later stages, you basically have to like stay on the wall while you fight in the Coliseum. It's pretty rough. All these spikes and stuff are on the side and below, and you're in like a very small arena. That's not the end, this is like halfway. keep this like armor guys on the screen as long as possible. So they're so easy to heal against. Oh, that was a fast refire. Come over here, you little bug. Charge up. This is literally like, can you time your swing? Yes. The answer is yes, I can. That is explode. Big fatty. Whoa. So 
one. Kill the other one. Alright. Low on soul, high on health. What's up? Oh, that's it. Okay, not too bad. But we get our other piece of King Soul. And King Soul costs one. So, infinite mana forever. Well, that's pretty sweet. Uh, we should probably put that on, huh? Looks like uh, I am meant to do a... Yeah, so you see that the soul is pulsing in the background. Alright, so we got our king soul. Uh, that's pretty sweet. Um, yeah, so we'll call it there. So I'm going to wait till my soul gets back up to max. Uh, let's see if any other charms that I wanted to put on. Dash Master can just come off. It's trash. So itself, fragile strength, quick slash, quick focus are amazing. So, yeah, feeling pretty good with where we're at. Fragile strength is not worth that. All right, so that's going to wrap it up for this session. Um, we're going to continue to go on. Um, I'm probably not going to full clear this. Um, probably just going to um, take take the endings as they come. If, if I get an easy full clear ending, fine, but I'm not going to be looking for it. Uh, so I think next time we'll come back and swing back to Crystal Mountain. Lots of spawn points there and see what we get. So thanks for watching, guys, and hope you guys all have a great night.